Okay, welcome back. So we're gonna start our next HOH competition, which will decide our next HOH. Um, for this competition, we're going to play the circle, which some of you may know. We did like a mini version last night with a few people, but we're gonna add some different things. So in this competition, we're all, all of the house guests will stand in a huge circle and there's gonna be different rounds. And every round will be a minute and 30 seconds. And during that minute and 30 seconds, you all can talk to each other, strategize, and after the minute and 30 seconds, you have to vote for someone to get out of the circle. So you're all gonna close your eyes after a minute and 30 seconds, and I'm gonna tap you on the shoulder and you'll point to the person you want to vote for. And then whoever has the most votes will get out. Does that make sense? Like, okay, Wait. you tap on the shoulder and you can... This is live feed? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, you have to memorize where they are. I the thought yesterday that we didn't really talk. Uh, yesterday we didn't talk, but today we're going to talk. Yeah. And then when it gets to three people left, there's going to be three people in the circle. And how it's going to work is one person will receive two votes, and one person will receive one vote, and the other person will receive zero votes. Whoever gets zero votes wins HOH. Does that make sense? Okay, and if there's a tie, we'll do a re-vote, and you can only vote for the people who had the most votes. Okay, so starting <laughs> now, you have a minute and 30 seconds oh. to talk. Oh, All right. On All right, raise your hand oh. if you want to be HOH. <laughs> 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 no, 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 you can't move. What? Is everyone's eyes closed? Mm -hmm. Alright, everyone open your eyes. Craig, you're eliminated. <laughs> <laughs> how, about this? how about this? I'll vote for me also if that everyone hat? else agrees to vote for her this round. What? <laughs> <laughs> you, right you, now? Vote yourself. Am, you cannot no, no, no. vote for yourself. Oh, that's, a, that's a rule. You cannot vote for yourself. Let's see. Oh, what? Alright, everyone close your eyes. Close your eyes. No talking. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Alright, everyone close your eyes. Everyone open your eyes. Nicole, you're eliminated. Dang. All right. I see how it is. Dang. Wow. Yeah. So what's everyone's favorite color? How's, how's you guys break? Uh, yeah, I think I should stop this. Are you getting there? What? <laughs> All right. Everyone close your eyes. Close your eyes. Oh! <laughs> 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 
Alright, everyone, open your eyes. Rachel, you've been loving <laughs> okay, now I think we actually should talk through this. I do, I do. Um, does anybody not want to be head of household? I guess they would. That's what I was at the same time. I'm not I feel sure. sick with all you guys? Yeah. <laughs> you just want the power of veto. That's I'm not sure true. if you want yeah. more responsibilities. Are you trying to tell her? Alright, everyone open your eyes. Haley, you've been eliminated. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right, this is this is the round where the HOH will be decided. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, wait. Can you explain that? So, can we so, explain before we start? Yeah. 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 So, um, basically, just like how it will work is one person will receive two votes, and one person will receive one vote, and then one person will get zero votes. Whoever gets zero votes wins. Oh, I see. I get it. Yeah. So the person that gets the two votes basically decides that each way. So pretty much yes. the only thing, if it ties, the only way it can tie is if we each vote for somebody different. Let's do it. <laughs> but then we'll just have to re vote again. You kind of just have to come up with a plan here. All right. Okay. 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 So a little concerned, I like I think everybody like can like see past that that I I have a lot of friends in the house. Uh, but I kinda wanted to juice things up. We all at the end didn't want to be like head of household and we agreed at the end. Sorry Hannah, you said this at the moment is not a good time for you to be HOH. And you told me a few days ago you want to be HOH third, not first or second. So using that information, hope you like being head of a household. But that being said, I don't think you're gonna put me up at the same time, so yeah. Um, but I think it was a good choice just for everybody. I didn't want to be head of household. I knew it would be bad for Shayna to be head of household and also for Haley to be head of household after she won the power veto, so getting less blood on her hands. So in the end, I got blood on my hands for putting up Hannah, but ultimately in the end, she'll get more blood on her hands. I don't want each to each this early. <laughs> The thing is, like, it paints a target on your back and Jesse backstabbed me. Well, we're in an alliance now and he made me HOH and... <laughs> I have too many alliances right now. <laughs> Do you have an idea of who you want to put on the block? Well, I could go for a big threat and really change things or... <clears throat> I could go for a big threat and really shake up things, or I could go for people that have grudges against me, or people that I just don't really appreciate in the game. Who are those people? <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. Jesus is the biggest threat, honestly. Um, especially because he hasn't tried to approach me about a alliance and a lot of the other bigger threats have um <laughs> uh i also know that sean doesn't like me <laughs> and sean and janelle are sticking together and if no one gets them out they'll just stick together forever um but i mean i'm always open to what people will tell me uh i really don't mind simon i don't know what people have against him um He's just kind of crazy. Adds fun to the game. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm in too many alliances. Get me out. <laughs> Your first night, Rachel approached me and said she wanted to be alliance with me and Craig. And she was like, you're my, you're my top two. Like, which means that I'm her second favorite because Craig is obviously her top person. Um, and then I'm pretty sure I'm in an alliance with basically all the freshmen and Jesse. But like that was like a whispered thing and like really like quickly yesterday at um banana grams um fairly certain jeremy is like the person i trust the most in the entire game like he's he's a straight shooter he's not gonna do anything weird 
Um, and then now I'm in an alliance with Jesse. <laughs> he's, he's a strong player. He could backstab me really easy. Um, but he nominated me for HOH, which means he trusts me. So, I don't know. So like, if you were HOH, what would you Put do? Put your cell phone! <laughs> Is that allowed? <laughs> no, that's not allowed. <laughs> Never know. I'm honestly surprised that so so you didn't go for any of the people who were on Survivor just because they're a little bit more <coughs> challenged wise and know how to strategize more because they've been in the game show already. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but I just kind of wanted to play the same thing. Yeah, I mean, if, if I would have gone after them, maybe we would have Definitely putting Kelly up there, though. Yeah, I think Kelly would have been Then it's Simon and Trey would just like do a bonus because I, I knew that no one was going to like, want them out seriously. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think this is the point where the lines will start to show. I would hope that my uh, nominations would further the game, mm -hmm. but uh, I don't know. But that's why it would also be easier to put people who you know who you can't trust up on the voting, because then you can get rid of them first, and then it'll be more easier to pick out at the end. Yeah. You're right. So, do you have, like, names? Um... <laughs> I mean, I've heard things that happened on in Survivor, and I mean, I'm kind of a little bit confused where Kevin is right now, because um, I saw how he was in Survivor, so I feel like, you know, he might be um, thinking a lot of things right now, so. Yeah. And right now, he's kind of uncertain, so. Mm -hmm. Do you have another one, or is it just Kevin? Um, I mean, Sean knows a lot, too, and I mean, I know me and him are talking, but that's also because we're, we're like, yeah, let's just talk about this. Yeah. But It's still early, too. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Sorry. So it's kind of hard to determine where things are going to head, because mm -hmm. right now, it's a little bit too early to really fully understand. I mean, for my kind of perspective, I think maybe just to be safe, maybe Simon just put up there, because you know, he's already on it. Can yeah. I ask why you put up Simon? Just to like a, just put him up there, because I knew he didn't really have like any, like, strong alliances with anyone, not, not that I know of any. I know he was quite his game manipulative, though, because so. during the uh, HOH game yesterday, um, he was signaling cues to people to go vote out people. And so that's how you win. Yeah, that is. Unless you get backstabbed. But you won. <laughs> but I didn't want to win! It's like, that's how you win. <laughs> but I won! <laughs> but I didn't want to win! Not, all of us didn't want to win. Oh, Craig! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> so, here I am, minding my own business in five alliances. Yep, totally. <laughs> Basically dying. It's fine. Um, also, Jesse made me HOH. I think he wants to, me to seem more powerful than I am, so he's less of a threat. He's not telling me that, though. Um... <laughs> He also just told me he also likes to talk. We both like to talk. Here's the thing. He wants Craig out, and Craig's in our alliance. <laughs> also, he just doesn't like Craig because of how much he's saying that, as a joke, that Jesse should get out. That's the only reason he doesn't like Craig. It's fine. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing <laughs> literally just texted I okay. Craig wants us to meet as the seventh heaven group at BJ after this filming of the confessionals um, also had to message Craig separately to tell him I want to talk to him separately from the group also um, <laughs> I don't know where Simon and I think Simon and um, Haley are working together but that's fine. <laughs> um, I don't know if I have more tea. That's my tea of the day. You're welcome. <laughs> I just totally messed up. I was like, Hannah, the reason why I put you up as HOH is because we're in our, we're in our alliance, 7th Heaven. And then she was like, oh, okay. But then Jeremy said, 
Yeah. We created that after HOH. <laughs> Whoopsie. Um, but I think I recovered well. It's because we're all so scared of Shayna. Shayna, Shayna. Also, I want Craig out because Craig's coming after Shayna. Um, at the moment, it seems like I'm working uh, with this group of seven that we've got. Just from people who are hanging around um, after, the after the competition last night. Um, I didn't expect to be working with these people, um, but we just kind of fell together and we were all talking. We didn't, we all agreed like we didn't have alliances and got together. Um, I'm still not convinced that there aren't alliances out there. I just can't see any except for um, Sean and Janelle. And it seemed like everyone agreed with that and that's why Hannah ended up putting them too up. So welcome to our power veto competition. Uh, we have given you each a number of blocks in front of you. You're going to take the two pencils and you're going to start with one block holding it in between the two pencils. And then you're going to hold it there for two minutes and we'll give you like 15 seconds in between to switch. And you'll add another block and then you'll do it with two for two minutes. Question, can we use either end of the pencil? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then once you drop, you're out. And we'll just keep going and adding blocks every two minutes until there's one person remaining. Three, <laughs> two, one. That was really go. low.
video ceremony, me and Jonelle have been nominated by the HOH for nomination to be evicted. Um, I have decided to use the power of veto on myself. <gasps> <laughs> so, really? Hannah, since we're the head of our school, you need to pick a new nomination for eviction. It was not my intention to backdoor anyone uh, as OHOH, and as such, I am giving, I am nominating a person without a chance to save themselves. Um, Kevin, I'm putting you up for a All righty, let's do it. <laughs> this power of veto ceremony has been adjourned. Um, uh, I'm actually fairly okay. okay. Uh, I knew Sean was going to use the veto on himself uh, just because it seemed like more people would, would vote for him and so I kind of figured that was coming out and so um, for eviction tomorrow I'm not too scared uh, just because people know how Kevin was in Survivor and so he might be unpredictable and so it seems like people may lean towards him but like i also understand that people may want to break up me and sean and that's totally okay too so like i honestly can see this going both ways and so i'm pretty chill about it <laughs> we've been talking to nicole lately and uh she mainly just wants some people who seem very trustworthy and um i mean i don't really want to backstab anyone and i personally wouldn't um just because I'm also pretty oblivious because <laughs> I'm just like I don't know what's much going on but I have some assumptions and that's about it um, so I don't think we have the strongest alliance but I can see why people would want to break it up just because me and Sean talk all the time and uh, so I can also see why Nicole would want to join in on that just because we talk all the time and so we could be strategizing a lot but I'm also pretty oblivious so <laughs> So, as you guys may have learned, is that I got uh, nominated, re-nominated, I guess, in a way, by Hannah. Um, so, I mean, this is a little bit surprising. You know, I thought maybe, like, oh, Hannah would be on my side. But, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, so I'm, I'm, not, I'm not too worried, actually. Uh, so, I mean, I'm, you know, by the time eviction ceremony comes up, it's uh, I'm pretty fairly certain what my fate's going to be. All right, well... See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> that was very nerve-wracking. I thought I was going to go out at six blocks because I was just hanging on the corners of the erasers. But after six blocks was over and Ethan said that we were going to, that we had 15 seconds left, I found where I wanted the pencils and I refused to move my hands from that position. So I knew that I was going to be set for a while, whereas Craig was completely unprepared for that. So I knew I kind of sort of had it in the bag. Despite me and Jonelle being in alliance, I have anticipated backstabbing her from the night before on the second when we had that little meet and greet session. So, Paul is in our alliance, and I have been talking with Rachel on the side without either of them with me. So, okay. After seeing Survivor and like how she performed, despite a certain host in Big Brother backstabbing her. She definitely knows how to work her way around the game, so I knew she, I know she's a good asset to have. So, and plus, since she's close with Craig, as I can get on Craig's good side as well, that can say give me some leeway as well. Okay, I know my days are numbered here because I've been just stirring up the pot so much because that's what you're supposed to do in this game: is stir up the pot. Um, but. I think Hannah and I have a pretty good relationship. I don't think she'll try and, like, maybe she could backdoor me. Um, uh, I have a number one priority list that somebody that needs to be gone, um, and that is Craig. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Um, yeah, we're friends outside of this game, but he's just like, pull, like, he's a firecracker right now. He's like, Oh, yeah, like, oh, just put up Jesse jokingly. But if you say things jokingly like that, then people will start to click. And I think people are starting to click, realizing that maybe I might not be the best person to keep in. Um, Hannah has questioned me, like, why didn't you make Shayna become HOH? And the reason why is because I want Hannah to get a little bit of blood on her hand, and I didn't want Shayna or me to get blood on my hand, because Shayna and I did a little pinky promise at the beginning. 
Um, but I'm saying, oh, it's because Shayna has no alliance. As Shayna's been playing a very terrible, terrible social game. She's like not talking to anybody. So I might just like drop that one right there too. Um, but so my number one hit list is Craig because he's like throwing out like, oh, maybe Jesse. And then just back then he's like, Jesse, what game shows have you been in? And I'm like, and what places have you got? And I'm like, oh my gosh, Craig, are you really gonna do this right here, right in front of everybody? Like, sure, I played the mole, I didn't get far. I did Survivor, I didn't get that far actually. But my other game show, All Stars, yes, I won. But he oh, seems yeah. like he doesn't know about that or forgot about that, which is a good thing. And I guess in the con, I backstabbed some people too. So, I don't know. Number one target's Craig. Um, now it is kind of difficult since uh, one of them is pulled down and now Kevin's up there. And I don't know, I want to talk uh, with the alliance I have to see if we want to go for Janelle still or go for um, Kevin because it's, it was, we wanted to get Sean out. Um, but now he's got the power of veto. Mm -hmm. So are we going to go for Kevin or are we going to go for Janelle? I don't know. But that's kind of where we're between. Um, I think we're still going to go for Janelle just because the alliance is what we were attacking in the first place. Um, but we were really trying to go for Sean instead. So this might be a good opportunity to get Kevin out and get um, get Sean out some other time. And um, I just don't see Janelle as a threat at this point. So getting her out so early doesn't seem as advantageous as getting Kevin out. And I think Jesse and Shana could both be after me. Um, I'm really fortunate that Jesse is in the alliance I'm in, um, although that would give him a very huge window to backstab me. Um, but at least for now, he won't be going after me until later in the game. Um, I think, aside from that, I don't know of anyone who has a target on my back, um, but that could change at any time. Hi! So, last night, Jesse told me some things. <laughs> Um, apparently he doesn't like Craig because Craig's been, uh, coming too close to the truth and Jesse won all stars. Thanks for that. Um, Kelly and Shana are the only ones that know because they were also in all stars and apparently that's great. Good news though. He never faced a jury before. He was never on a jury before. That's pretty good. Also. I spent like until two in the morning this morning watching lives on Facebook. I'm really pathetic, but like I did. Also, hi Danny. <laughs> um, I wish you had confessionals, <laughs> honestly, because nothing about that, all the competitions, no strategies going on. That's what I was looking for. It's okay, I'm not salty. <laughs> This is the eviction ceremony. So Janelle and Kevin, you have both been placed on the block for eviction. Um, you each have one minute to make your case as to why you should stay in the house. Janelle, you may start. Um, I think I should stay in the house because I really still wanna play the game with you guys. And um, well, yeah, I just wanna enjoy some more time playing Big Brother. Thank you. Uh, Kevin? Uh, yeah, so, um, no, kind of same thing with you, Janelle. Just kind of like, I really just like doing these things because, you know, I've done you know, Survivor twice and whatnot. But, uh, you know, uh, I'm trying to think of some stuff right now. Let's see. Um, I don't know. If you guys, guys want to keep me on, you guys can keep me on. Uh, it's not like a win or lose situation right now, honestly. Uh, best of luck to you guys. Uh, thank you, Kevin. Uh, so, house guests, everyone except for the HOH, who is Hannah, and our two nominees will vote for either Jonelle or Kevin to be evicted from the house. Um, so, you guys are voting for the person you want to be evicted. Uh, so, one by one, you'll enter our diary room to cast your vote on who you want to evict. Hi, Jeremy. Hi. Please cast your vote to evict. Uh, Kevin. Thank you. Hi, Jenna. Hi, Julie. Please cast your vote to evict. I vote to evict Kevin. Thank you. Thank you, Julie. Hi, Jesus. Hello, Ethan. Uh, please cast your vote to evict. Um, I sadly vote to evict Kevin. Thank you. 
Hi, Craig. Hi, Ethan. <laughs> Please cast your vote to evict. I vote to evict Kevin. Thank you. Hi, Simon. Hey. Uh, please cast your vote to evict. Kevin. Thank you. Hi, Jesse. Hi, Ethan Chen. <laughs> please cast your vote to evict. Sorry, but it seems like my alliance was in between both of the nominees, and we decided to fall on Kevin. So I, we evict. <laughs> I vote to evict Kevin. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> Bye, Julie Chen. You look stunning. Hi, Sean. Hi. <laughs> please cast your vote to evict. Um, I'd like to evict you, <laughs> JK. I'm gonna want Kevin to be evicted. Thank you. Hi, Haley. Hi. Please cast your vote to evict. Uh, we're gonna go with Kevin. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi, Nicole. Hi, Ethan. Please cast your vote to evict. I evict Kevin. Thank you. <laughs> House guests, the votes are in. With a vote of 10 to 1, <gasps> Kevin, you have been evicted. Oh, my God. <laughs> So, uh, I just got evicted. Now, you might be thinking, like, oh, am I, like, pretty sad about this? I'm not really sad about this because, uh, I honestly really wasn't even trying my best in the game at all because, uh, you know, I was doing that all on purpose because I need to go back and actually do some homework. Uh, but... I mean, thank you, because it's. I kind of really wanted to be evicted, so I mean, you kind of guys, you guys saved yourselves on that one. Um, but it was exciting to play for a bit. Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much. Uh, Kevin, I'm just, I'm really, I'm really sad to see you go. Just the rest of the house wanted you to go, and I was trying to root for Jonelle because of because of Sean and like them clearly having something, but looks like it didn't, looks like it didn't work out and really sorry, but you've been a great player this game. I really love your personality. I just have one question. What's in the bag, Kevin? Sorry I had to go, Kevin, but like if you didn't want to play, like you shouldn't have been telling people that. Kevin, I love you, man. Um... I heard that you didn't really want to uh, play this game, so um, the main group was just like, yeah, you know, if, if he doesn't want to play the game, then let's just boot him. So, um, I mean, I love you. I wish I wish you could play the game. It would have been awesome maybe to have an alliance, even though you probably would have backstabbed me. That would have been fun. I love getting backstabbed. Um, <laughs> yeah. Kevin, I'll miss you. Um, have fun doing homework. Hi! Um, so I texted Kevin today. I was like, you might want to start playing if you want to get off the block. Because, like, the numbers are really against you. Like, I laid it all out there. I mean, 10 to 1. Feel bad for that one, by the way. Also, he just was like, okay, I don't really have any tricks up my sleeve. And then he kind of threw away his speech. It's okay. He didn't want to work with me. I asked him to work with me. He didn't want to. Bye.